and I'm not here to be a moralist, um, but the more I read about alcohol, basically no alcohol. I mean, it's unfortunate, um, but it doesn't mean you don't have to have any alcohol. It doesn't necessarily follow if you have a drink, but I guess it's about excess. But what do you think about alcohol and drugs? Well, you're right. If, if you want to be really healthy, there's no alcohol mm. and you have to work out a lifestyle. Um, that's a lifestyle decision. The current idea is that two to three standard drinks three to four times a week for a male and one to two for a female is inverted commas healthy drinking. But in a way, the, the recommendation is no drinking. So no doctors booze. would say no drinking. Yep. And we're looking at levels that are called healthy, but there's no such thing as healthy levels. Yeah. So you have to just take that on board. So you are taking a risk when you drink no matter what. Absolutely. Because alcohol itself is okay, but it's the acetyl aldehyde that gets produced, which is the poison. Yes. And your brain doesn't like it. And it's Nothing toxic like to it. the brain. It's toxic, yeah. And a bit like we're talking about the, you know, punches to the head, it's an it's a cumulative effect. Yeah. And and it's not healthy. Yeah. And and drugs, like let's call let's call it recreational drugs, because just about every kid in Australia these days takes cocaine if they're under thirty. They don't even drink, they just take cocaine. It's out of control. Um cocaine, marijuana very unhealthy. Unhealthy. Yeah. Again. Dangerous. And unfortunately, it can be just like a first episode of cocaine can lead to a spasm of a blood vessel. It can lead to brain hemorrhages. Plus, we don't even know, you know, what's in the cocaine. Where's it come from? What's being mixed in with it? So very unhealthy. What about, what about 